ministering in these difficult countries has presented severe challenges. In Ibadan, Nigeria, a 34-year-old cripple from birth suddenly got up on the platform and walked. In India, there was this man who had been operated, a metal had been put in his leg for eight years. He had gone through 15 operations, and the Holy Spirit gave me a word of knowledge. I walked up to him, took his crutches from him, and asked him to walk, and suddenly he began to walk. And another man, who was told by physicians that he had only two weeks to live, was completely healed. Bishop Ejin Asari's vision is to reach the whole world with the gospel of Christ. He is therefore raising an army for the kingdom through the school of ministry that Dr. Sarulu started. In the last two years, he has been privileged to host Dr. Morris Sarulu in the nation of Ghana twice. These occasions have been times when the nation has been greatly impacted. The Elijah Impartation Institute was awesome. It was a blessing to the nation. Many leaders and ministers came from across Ghana to be impacted. The nothing wanting financial anointing has also been a blessing to so many ministries and individuals. People are beginning to see God meet their needs as never before. Bishop Charles Ajin Asari believes that Dr. Cerullo is really a prophet and an apostle of God for our generation. Dr. Cerullo, thank God for your life and the commission he gave you to raise an army. Many people have been raised. I am one of them. You have greatly impacted your generation. Dr. Cerullo, we thank God for your life. We believe in you. Keep on, Papa. God bless you. So say hallelujah. This morning, in the next few minutes, I'm going to lead you to pray. But before I lead you to pray, as I took my, as I went to the bathroom this morning, the Lord said to me, there were three people who were going to come here who had a problem either with their waist or their legs and they will be coming with sticks and they couldn't walk. Now listen to me. If you want to, if you want to, you can walk to me now. You came with a stick. If you want to, walk to me now. You came with a stick. If you want to, walk to me now. You came with, come with, when you're coming, come with your stick. 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 Miracles are happening. Come with your stick. Come with your stick. The power of the Lord. The power of the Lord is present to you. Let's go. He has the power of the Lord. Give the Lord a mighty clap offering. If you want to, you can walk. If you want to, you can walk. If you want to, sister, let's go back here. Yes, let's go back here. If you want to, come with your stick. If you want to, you can walk. You want to. Your stick is back there. Bring my stick. Bring my stick. Bring it now. Where is my stick? Where is my stick? Somebody, yes. If you want to, you can walk. If you want to, you can walk. If you want to, you can walk. Miracles taking place. Miracles. Now, all those who have given me your sticks, all those who have given me your sticks, yes, walk this way. Walk with me now. Mama, walk with me. Oh. Walking all over the place. Shout hallelujah. Shout hallelujah. Miracles. Miracles are happening. Miracles are happening. Miracles are happening. Something is about to hit your life. There is something that is going to happen in your life. Eyes have not seen, nor ears heard the things that God has reserved for his people. Lift up your hands and shout yes! Shout yes! Miracles all over this place. Let me hear some of your testimonies. Please take your seats with me for a few minutes. Who's, whose is this? Whose is this? Whose stick is this one? 
Whose stick is this one? Yes, come. Yes. What was wrong with you? I, um, I got bad knees. Just how long? Bad knees for how long? Two years. Two years. And so when you were coming, show me how you came. Show me how you came. This is how you came. And now give me your stick. And I walk here. Let me see. Yeah, Lord, that's right. Give the Lord praise. Give the Lord praise. Yeah, mama, you can go sit down. Glory to Jesus. Where's your seat? This one. This one. Show me how you came. Yeah. Show me how you came. Hallelujah. Glory. Give him praise. We are having church. Have you used the stick? Uh, my husband, oh, I'm seven years now. Seven years now. Because he had divorced me, but I got four kids. And the kids love the day. So I just stuck it out. Usually caregivers die first. But I'm still here. He's in Arlington Cemetery. I didn't hate him enough. But he told the kids. But now you are walking. Jesus. Now you are walking. Now you are walking. Hallelujah. Mama, where's your stick? Which one? Brand new one. Okay, this is your stick. Show me how you came. You came like this. And now give me your stick. And I walk here. Let me see. Whoa, shout hallelujah. Only Jesus can do this. Only Jesus can do this. Give the Lord praise, somebody. Give the Lord praise. Give the Lord praise. Give the Lord praise. Let me pray for you. Let me pray for you. Put your hand on your forehead. Let me pray for you. Heavenly Father, I pray for your people. I ask that their healing will be permanent. And I ask for strength and health and physical vital for them. In Jesus' name. If you are sick in any part of your body, lift up one hand. Lay the other hand where you are hurting and get ready to be healed. You know, we, we, we didn't pray for them. In most of my meetings, I don't even get to prayer time. And the cripples start walking and blind eyes start opening. Because there's awesome power here already. You're sick in any part of your body. Heavenly Father, we give you praise. We give you thanks. We exalt you. There is none like unto you, Lord. And this morning, Lord, we take authority over every spirit of sickness and disease. Satan, you know me and you would obey me. For I don't come in my name. I come in that powerful and miraculous name of Jesus. And every spirit of blindness, I command you to be bound now. Every spirit of deaf and dumbness, be bound in Jesus' name. Every spirit of lameness, be bound in Jesus' name. You foul spirit of cancer, I bind you, I curse you to die at the roots. You spirit of growth and skin diseases and pain, I command you to leave God's property. Leave these people, let them go free in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Lift up your two hands, open your mouth and talk to God and claim the anointing, claim the extra measure for your life now. Claim it now, 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 claim it now. Name of the, hey, we have the victory in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, hey, hey. 